the let's do some skilling We got a level one fire making. Level four, let's go. And we got a wood cutting level. And we got another fire making level. Let's go. All right, we got another cooking level. And of course I am speeding this up because, uh, because let's face it, uh, sometimes it can be kind of boring just to uh, sit and watch some people uh, uh, skill. Uh, so we'll just kind of speed up some of the more boring parts. All right, we got a uh, defense level. And so we're also uh, using the chickens to help some of our combat skills as well. So uh, we can build those up and start attacking uh, stronger things. All right, here we go. We got another wood cutting level. Nice. All right, we got yet another wood can level. Uh, I've forgotten how easy it was to get levels, but sometimes difficult to get levels this early, um, especially with some of the RNG stuff, but uh, uh, some of the early levels are easy to get if you uh, get some of the good RNG. So good and bad, but uh, yeah, we're making some slow, steady progress. some uh, fire making so as you can see we're 
Okay, there's some wood cutting, some fire making. We'll probably do some fletching soon. Um, so yeah, we are uh, moving forward. I'm coming in with another fire making level. Nice. Gotta love it. And of course here we're working on some more fire making and of course we get yet another level. And of course we got another wood cutting level and you know like wood cutting, fire making and fletching kind of all pretty much go hand in hand. A lot of times you kind of level up those skills. Uh, in similar fashion, so to speak, around the same time. Um, essentially, you can just chop down, make do some fire, fletch, then you can sell some of the stuff, so it kind of all uh, blends together, so to speak. Alright, another fire making level. And we'll just continue on uh, working on these skills. And then we'll probably work on some combat skills and some fletching a little bit later here. Uh, essentially what we can do is we can make some arrows so we can chop down some wood, do some fletching, and then we can get the fletching for making the arrows and then get some combat stuff, get some feathers, and then get some more fletching experience. So kind of all go hands in hand. Of course you can forget the uh, prayer bonus and of course working on some more combat skills, leveling up, very nice. And these are, we'll essentially work on the chickens for a little while, get our combat skills up and then we can uh, go kill some of the cows, so it'll be nice. And as you can see, we're using some of the wood over here to do some fletching, and we got a nice little fletching level up here. Um, some of the wood over here is pretty good if you're low level, but I mean, as you get higher levels, it's going to become fairly superfluous. But uh, for now, it can uh, be pretty important to help us through some of the early fletching levels. And you can also do it for fire making because you don't have to cut it down, but again, then you don't get the, uh, the uh, experience of wood chopping and then doing unifier making or fletching. Alright, we got another uh, wood cutting level. Again, we're uh, slowly, uh, I believe that was an attack level, so working on our combat skills. And so it's kind of, this is kind of like the wood cutting, fire making, uh, fletching interaction. You can get the combat plus fletching and then get some 
food and then cook that and get some cooking experience. So it's uh, all interconnected, as I said. Again, we got a uh, strength level, so uh, pretty soon we'll be able to. I attacked one of the cows earlier and just take a little bit too long, so once we get some of these leveled up, we'll be able to get some of the cows and some of the uh, meat for cooking, bones for bearing, and of course the hides for some. Um, what do you call the skill? Uh, crafting. Crafting. You can do a lot of stuff with the crafting, so. We're, we're doing it. All right, we got a uh, fletching level. And so we can make uh, some javelins now, so. I guess that'll be nice, although I'm probably not going to have too many uh, reasons to make them, unless I just want to sell some of the stuff, so... Alright, coming in with uh, another strength. And I believe that's another defense. Oh, sorry, combat level. We're going to be uh, working on uh, one of the quests. In fact, we're probably going to be doing like two quests, both the sheep here and the uh, cook's assistant was probably be the next one that we do.
Alright, we're um, about to finish the uh, cook's assistant quest. It's fairly simple, as is the cheap shares. It just gets you. This should get us some uh, a little bit of cooking experience, which goes a long way in the lower levels. At the upper levels, it doesn't really do much, so it's worth it to kind of do it. Early on, we already milked the cow and we uh, already uh, made the flour and got a pot, so. Uh, should be about it. She gave us uh, one uh, quest point, of course, 300 cooking experience, so that would be nice. Not quite sure if we get. Oh, yeah, we do get a level. I'm just not sure if we barely nicked that in the. Uh, Alright, we got a cooking level on that. We got some crafting. Uh, so uh, we're off to a pretty good start. Of course, I grabbed some onions. Not because I really needed them right now, but I uh, can always use them later. And I got another uh, load of uh, wool um, to maybe see if we can sell those and make a little bit of GP a little bit later on. We'll see. Not quite sure what we're going to do next, but we'll figure something out. Alright, working on some uh, hit points. That's going to be really important too. Alright, should be getting a... Uh, uh, yep, there we go. Another woodcutting level. And we'll just continue on with our uh, skilling escapades here. Got yet another woodcutting level, so we're making uh, good progress. It'll, this will start slowing down uh, the next couple of levels, uh, and I'll start uh, feeling more like a chore to do these skills, but for now it's not too bad. Be, yeah, I was about to say we're about to do for another uh, level here. So, yeah, I'm getting that uh, dopamine rush. We'll uh, work on some fletching here and um, hopefully get. Uh, and we should be getting another level here shortly. I think off this uh, next couple ticks. There we go. Got yet another level. Nice. Like I said, they kind of go hand in hand. So, we'll, we'll continue working on uh, some of these skills here. All right, so I uh, decided to uh, start working on some thieving. Uh, get that up to, I think uh, we're shooting for level five. There we go, there's a level. Um, 
kind of annoying to get the pickpocketing skill up to level 5, but once you do, then you can start stealing from some of the stalls, particularly the stalls over in um, Artie, and then you can get a whole bunch of uh, food until you can start stealing the uh, some of the silks and other stuff like that to uh, boost your thieving, but it starts improving after that. Uh, with some of these uh, pickpocket, early pickpocket levels are kind of uh, freakishly annoying due to all the uh, miss uh, knock up, so to speak. Should be getting a uh, thieving level here shortly, provided we uh, can pickpocket this person. Couple more ticks. Come on, you can do it. There we go. Got another level. I don't want to talk, we just want to continue to pickpocket. We uh, have been doing fairly well. And so, in, oh, there we go, right there. There's uh, another pickpocketing level. So, we just have, I think, one more to go, and then we can get level five and can take from the stalls in Artie. Alright, uh, and uh, there we go. We have uh, finally achieved our uh, basic thieving level that we can go over to Artie uh, once we get a little bit larger, higher combat sets. And then we have a little bit of gold, and then uh, we can uh, start stealing from fools, food stalls over there and get some uh, decent, uh, we call it the cakes or whatever. Yeah, that'll be nice. All right, strength and uh, combat. Uh, so that's nice, and we uh, get the uh, the initial uh, thing. The, the, we have to talk to a guy to get some uh, I, some uh, beginning items, but uh, very nice. We'll just uh, continue here for a while, gather up some supplies. As you see, some of the meat and the cowhides, and that'll be for some uh, later experience.